Hey guys, welcome to another Unreal Engine tutorial. In today's episode, we'll be making a pit stop uh, with a couple of buildings there. And we'll also be making a little invisible box that when you go through it, it'll tell you to slow down. So that when you enter the pit stop, you don't go full speed ahead. Now we'll start by just selecting one of your splines and then holding control and clicking away from it and it'll just branch it off. You see right there, it made two of those. So then I'm just gonna click on the last one which will join them together. So it branches off and then it merges back in. And I'm just gonna delete a couple of those because I made a bit too many. Now I'm just gonna reposition these. Also, like I said before, you don't have to do it exactly like me. You can do your own little thing, your own little environment. I'm just making it like this because I think it looks cool. But you guys are free to do whatever. I'm just going to turn these because right now they're doing this weird little thing. So you can rotate them. And now... I imported this little building into my file so that I can have a pit stop building which you guys can also download in the link down below it's just my little Google sites that I made for you guys with all the little things that I added to my projects now this is a bit too big so I'll put it to 0.5 and then I'll just go ahead and edit all the colors to because I don't want this little light pink and light blue Okay, so now what I'm going to do is just control C, control V, and copy paste it over there. And do that again a couple of times. Probably five or six times because I want to, I want a lot of these garages. I want them to go all the way until the end of the, the road. And there you go, that looks like enough for me. They're all nicely placed there. Let me just test that out. So yeah, it looks pretty, pretty realistic. It's not like the best thing. I could spend a bit more time and make it look better, but for this tutorial, I'll just make it quick and simple. Now I'm gonna create a new folder and call this one Blueprints. And that's where I'll be putting in my, my little invisible box to tell me to slow down. And I'll create another one called widgets. Widgets are things that pop up on the screen. And from here I can go in user interface and create new widget. I'm just call I'm just gonna call this one slow. And now I imported this little slow sign that's a PNG because I don't want a background, right? And then I'm gonna import this image. And then go in here and look up slow. Oh, no, I guess it's named something else. It's called untitled. So in here, I'll call, I'll look up untitled, unnamed. And let's just go 300 by 300. And here you can set to 0.5.5 on the alignment. And on the X and the Y, you'll change it to zero and also anchor it to the center so that it's in the center center. 
and then I'm just gonna go ahead and move that on the Y and the Z, uh, sorry, the Y and the X. And there you go, you got a nice little slow widget right there. Gonna compile and save that. And now let's go in our blueprints folder. And let's create a new blueprint class and a blueprint actor. It's called this box. And then box, we're gonna go here and just scroll down and found, find box collision and just bring that in let's leave the box name and then go ahead and select that scroll all the way to the bottom and click on begin overlap and go back to viewport and select it and go on begin end overlap and now what i'm going to do is just do create new widget so you can slide that out of uh, begin overlap and do add to viewport and then also select slow the widget that we created and then out of the value you want to do uh, remove from parent and that's going to be on the end overlap so that when you leave the box so when you enter it says slow and when you get out it stops saying slow okay so end overlap and begin and there you go so that's all that i have for you guys today in this tutorial and i'll see you guys next week